This is a Viking Legend 12 RB. And there's damage from high wind. It should have actually been avoidable. They've only attached this roofing panel via one, two, three, what, six screws along here. And then these really chintzy rivets here that are way smaller than the whole size. I presume that's for ease of alignment in the factory. But as you can see, there's no damage here. So these are just sheared off. And these six screws are not even bent along here. So they've just torn straight through this it's thin sheet metal. That's all that touches it. There's some adhesive in here, but the adhesive is only touching the styrofoam. So that's not going to do much. Um, one of these brackets here has come out. And again, it's not bent the screw or anything. It's just maybe not attached to enough. And the same to this end, same damage, not bent at all. So that's just fastener failure there and not having enough adhesive. If the adhesive had been along this edge, attaching to this stronger skin here, that might have worked. And I don't know if they've used good enough plywood delaminated here it's all delaminated even even at the other end and then when it blew off it also damaged this one this is quite a seems to be a hard to find dimension of channel here but you can see that's just split when it, this whole wall you know doubled back on itself or whatever it did damaged the door